If elected as the MP for Rochdale, what will you do for Rochdale? If I was elected as the MP for Rochdale, I'd make sure that the truth came out about all the different scandals, what's been going on. Um, I would make sure that the people that had ignored what was going on, who have been pensioned off and given lump sums and gone quietly, I would make sure they were called back and had to answer for the ignorance, basically. The same as anybody in the care jobs, anybody in the local authorities, any of the councillors that ignored what was going on with the grooming, I would make sure that they all answered for turning a blind eye. And obviously the council do take responsibility. Colin Lambert, the former council leader, admits that the Rochdale Council let the children of Rochdale down. So there's a lot to answer for there and I still believe that it's, good, it's still going on now. The grooming gangs are still at large and it needs stopping. I would also make sure that every councillor that has abused expenses were made to count, um, you know, that they were brought to, to justice. I would try and do what I could for the, the town centre, basically. I believe that the council has spent millions on the new tram system, but the town centre itself is very unattractive. Um, all I see is the tram system taking people out of Rochdale. When you compare it to somewhere like Bury, where nearly everybody I know either goes to Bury or to Manchester to do the the clothes shopping and you know any any other kind of shopping really Rochdale Centre to me is not an attractive place and why should people vote for you well on the, on the basis of what I've just said really